Good morning. Got the coffee. It's funny, these robins fly down here after I mowed. They're very, very brave. They like to get in all the bugs. You know, when you when your grass is so tall, they get all the bugs after you cut it. A couple of brave robins, man. They 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 almost came up to me as I was mowing. I've got the cat over here. <laughs> Robin, I just saved your life. <laughs> Scared the cat. <sighs> so, I, I've developed this new habit, right? I've developed a new habit. It's something I was doing for a while earlier this year, but I've gotten back into it. Now, I've been watching uh, a guy named Ryan Mickler. His, the name of his YouTube is uh, Order of Man. He's got a podcast as well. And he talks about, you know, healthy steps to becoming a better, a better man, right? Which is what I'm always trying to be. And I've read... Both of his books, you know, it's, it's a lot of insight that I wish I'd had when I was 20, 25 years old, you know, still trying to figure things out. Anyways, better late than never, I guess. And he talked about, in one of his podcasts, he talked about doing a battle plan um, and writing down what you've accomplished You know, it's, it's funny. My wife will have all this stuff that she'll do throughout the day. And, but then if she sits down and watches TV for an hour, she gets upset and thinks that she's being lazy. She's like, you know, she, she asks me, you know, things like, you know, is my bad for doing this? I'm like, no. You've accomplished a lot today. And I thought, you know, I feel like I don't do anything, but then when I sit down and write down everything that I accomplished, no matter how small, you look at that list and you're like, okay, I've had a successful day. I've had a pretty good, pretty good day. And you can pick out things that were significant. In other words, like yesterday, I wrote down, you know, every little thing I did. And I thought, man, yesterday was kind of a hectic day. <laughs> but sometimes you don't feel like you've accomplished a lot, but then you, do, you have done a lot. You just don't realize it, but you feel stressed. Like, oh, these 20 things happened yesterday. That's why I feel tired. You might feel like you're treading water, and you're actually not. You're 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 going towards the same direction, the same goal. Anyways, so the new habit that I've done is throughout the day I have a piece of paper, or well, it's a notebook, a journal, if you will, where I list everything that I've accomplished that day. Like if I dispatched a truck or um, found three loads or had a good conversation with somebody, I, I list all of it. You know, yesterday was pretty full. And then there are other days where I may not write down much. I'm like, okay, why? Why did I not write down much? What, I, what, what could have I have accomplished? So, some random thoughts while sitting in the backyard. I didn't go for a walk today. I've got some work to do, but I just thought I'd, you know, walk around the backyard. 
You know, the problem with this backyard is we have a lot of poison ivy. I'd like to just burn all this vegetation. City might frown on that, though. And then this is all poison. A lot of it is, which is why I haven't touched it yet. And then, uh, yeah, there's a lot of poisonous vegetation back here. Stupid poison. Plants hate you. Anyways, uh, I just thought I'd put that out there. So if you feel like you don't accomplish anything, write down what you've done that day. Write down what you do today. Even if you're driving 11 hours, write down the conversations you had. You know, I, oh, I talked to so-and-so about this, or I talked to so-and-so about that, or I watched this YouTube channel, or I watched or listened to this podcast, you know. Write, write all that stuff down. See if that doesn't change a thing or two. Have a good day. I'll let you guys enjoy the, the silence of the dog barking in the background. Huh. <laughs>